up guys, your boy X here. Today we're doing a Tokyo Revengers Season 2 Episode 5 Live Reaction. So last we left off, um, the boys was with Kasaki's, um, uh, what you were saying, foreman or secret person in the Black Dragon, but he got found out. But at the end of the day, the other guy from the Black Dragon, he ended up asking for more money and told them the information they wanted uh, when the guy was basically free, which is Christmas Day. Uh, he likes to be alone because he's Christian. He likes to pray or whatever. So that's the information they got now. So let's go ahead and get started. But before we begin, I just want to shout out to our new sponsor in the form of Into the AM. First off, huge thanks to Into the AM. If y'all been watching my videos for a while now, then y'all know I've always been rocking these shirts, different colors all that good stuff <laughs> um, even yeah before I even became partners with him so I'm so happy that um and, you know, I got the chance to do it now, uh, so that should be a testament, because, uh, these are very comfortable, very comfortable shirts, you know, tight at the top, uh, very loose at the bottom, which I love, uh, but they got more stuff, you know, they got graphic tees that look amazing, they got joggers, they got all type of different clothes, uh, so just go ahead, check their, uh, <laughs> check their website out, I'll leave it in the description box below and the comment section, if you click on that sp special link right there, you will get 10% off of your order, um, full order, so so, you know, just be on the lookout for that. Once again, thanks to um, Into the AM. But, all right. About to begin this, guys. And five, four, three, two, one. Let's get. Oh, wait. Oh, <laughs> let's get. <laughs> Didn't start for some reason. Christmas night. I mean, is it because last episode boy was sucking on a lollipop with no worries? What, what are we talking about here? Hmm. The third or sixth division. Damn, man, that's pretty quick. Can I can can your boy get a full twenty four hours? <laughs> All right. He ain't lying. It's like, damn, man, they got, he got too many problems going on right now. And I mean, even if he just kicked out a Toman, I feel like he could still go after, and still go after people. He's crazy. Oh, if he's crazy, you know. Oh, man. Mm. <laughs> I gotta work with bastards to fight other bastards. <laughs> Smart decision. You look so cocky, dog. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> One screwed up team. No, Caesar's beatings actually sounds hilarious. Please. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> he just come up with that on the spot? That was good. <laughs> Don't shake his hand. What? <laughs> Damn. Wait, what? How does he... Huh? The same cram school. I guess it was cram elementary, I guess. I don't know. So that's interesting. They know each other. Or maybe, I don't know, somebody in the comment section will let me know what cram is, but I'm, I'm guessing elementary. They look like they're in elementary right now, if this is a flashback. God, I want to make a joke, but I don't want to make it. He just looks like that backpack kid, I'll say that in school. Holy shit. He looks like that person you gotta watch out for. It. They've got no heart. Probably because they're just alone. That's so not like him. Man, so that fool was smart all the way back then. This fool over here making a master plan. Okay, you're gonna uh, expound? Oh god, I'm about to go on a flashback when they hit you with that. It was the summer of sixth grade.
in the middle, dog. Big ass nose. <laughs> okay, it actually looks normal now. I guess the way they had the uh, the view. in the corner. I tried to stop her. Oh, so that was this fool in the, that was this fool in the opening. Hmm. A hero has arrived. Da -da -da -da! Ah, he actually said it. Oh, <laughs> oh snap. Boy, this, we got Saitama in this mug, huh? I mean, that boy came in with a flying entry, so I mean, I know he about, I know he about it, about it. So let's see what he got now. Don't tell me. What, what was the point? I wanted to see it. Did he get his, did he get his ass or? No. Oh, oh yeah, he did. <laughs> oh my God. See you. A hero never reveals his identity. <laughs> Gone. In a flash, he left as as quickly as he came. <laughs> How did she even know that was him? He, he didn't even say his name or nothing. Oh my god. Fourteen years ago. Oof. Where'd I get a cape? Uh, uh, it's debatable. That is, hmm. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that young love right there. Go ahead, shed a tear. I, I knew it. <laughs> he might be in the runner up for like a main character that cries the most, but his cries are usually um, warranted when he starts crying because either somebody dies in front of him or it's just like a sad moment. Here he felt the love, so I understand why he got a tear come out of his eye. Huh? Oh, I remember that, but... Mm, maybe somebody forces him to. <laughs> she cheats on <laughs> That's who is this guy? Oh, bro, well, I was like, traveling too. <laughs> oh, okay, maybe he's about to make it. Make him a Mr. Her. Boy said Naruto.
That's crazy, because he sure becomes a police officer in the future. <laughs> so you from the future or something, buddy? <laughs> Boy, snitching. <laughs> Had her almost choke on her damn <laughs> was a soup. I don't know what they're making. Okay. <laughs> Hita is in the love and love, y'all. Jesus, I can't imagine somebody saying that to their parents at that age, maybe, but I feel like you'd be keeping stuff from your parents, but well, that's a good relationship, so I can't fault it. You're a hoodlum? Well, damn, that went left real quick. Ah. Oh my god. Wow, this sucks. So, okay, we got the reason now. We got the reason now why he broke up with her in the future, but will he do it this time? go. Don't do it. Talk, talk to me if you don't do it. Oh, he did it. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> like, come on. Like, I hope she knows that he's lying because of the way he's talking. Oh. I'm so hurt right now. God damn! <laughs> oh, she a little psycho. She hit that boy with a right hook and a left hook. Oh, damn. Thought he would have tried to change that for the future. I mean, I understand. I understand what her dad said. I even understand the fact. She never found out why. God, it's kind of sad because it's like I, I can see both sides, you know, the parent and him being from the future where he knows all the events that happened. So it's like, damn. Oh, no. Ah. Oh. Spoiling
cried, cried about four times this episode. I'm just saying. All rightfully so. Oh my god. Plan ready to go. He's <laughs> like, I mean, I don't know, man. Us three outside will be tied you up. <laughs> I can't wait to see this. You can vent all your anger. Mm. Guys, God. <laughs> oh my God. Um, I'm, so, I'm, like, I'm kind of conflicted because, all right, so this episode basically they're getting their plan together. We're rapidly heading toward Christmas Eve or. I guess we are at Christmas Eve now, uh, but Christmas Day, we're rapidly getting there. And we got a couple things that happened this episode. Uh, first off, you know, they got their plan ready to go. They're like, all right, we're going to beat his ass. <laughs> Takamichi is basically going to try to stop um, Hakai from uh, killing, or yeah, Hakai from killing his uh, brother while the rest of them are beating his ass up. <laughs> So yeah, uh, we'll see how that goes. I doubt I doubt they can beat him, them three, but we'll see. But the main thing that happened in this episode was we got a lot with um, Hinata, uh, Tanjiro, uh, it was it Tanjiro, <laughs> Takamichi, <laughs> Hina, Takamichi, and um, um, uh, 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 Kasaki. God, uh, all three of them apparently. Um, Hina and Kasaki knew each other from back in the day because they had the same, they were in the same school, same class or whatever. And also, um, Takamichi had met them, um, uh, a while ago in the past when they were young as well, came up like a superhero and stuff and tried to protect Hina, uh, but he got his ass whooped, but that was the day she fell in love with him, so from then on out, you know, she wanted to reach out to him, and that's when they, like, got together later down the road, I think, like, when they start going to school together, and was it high school, middle, whatever damn grade they're in, so yeah, so that's when they met up and everything, right, now, Christmas Eve, if we remember one of the timelines, um, he actually goes to the park with uh, Hina and she starts crying, you know, she's like, this is the, you know, um, Christmas Eve, you broke up with me, I want to know why. So she never found out why, but here in this episode, we know the reason why, uh, because it is Christmas Eve. So apparently he ran into her dad. And her dad is actually kind of nice, or well, not kind of nice, it is nice. Um, and I'll get to, but, but it's nice, you know, because he thanks him. He's like, you know, I'm not really at home a lot or whatever. So I'm pretty sure my son hates that. But he actually said that he wants to become a police officer. I'm guessing that's because of you. And he knows I want to thank you for that or whatever, right? And, you know, uh,. You know, he's respectful, whatever, but he ends up telling him he wants him to break up with Hina because he's um, in a gang or whatever, and he's like, can you promise me that she won't get hurt in any of the shenanigans that you're dealing with? So, you know, I guess he can't. <laughs> I guess he can't. And so he ends up breaking with he breaking up with Hina because of that, and she beats the shit out of him, rightfully so. She's like, I hate you, and walks off. Now, I'm conflicted, but, like, you know, obviously... Yeah, when you're the parent, you want the best, right? So I'm pretty sure Takamichi under, uh, under, uh, uh, he, uh, he understood, right, why he said that and why he needed to break up with her. Um, on the other hand as well, you would think 
he would try to change the future more, maybe? I, I don't know. Like, I mean, maybe that was one future where he knew for sure she would be safe and breaking up with her because we do know she survived all the way up until that point. So it's really more so was dealing with the gang stuff, right? But... You know, because later, later on when they become adults, she's still alive, you know, and she even still loves him because she has the, the necklace, she has the necklace still, whatever. When they met at the park, she's like, you know, I loved you, you know, I love you, whatever, and crying, why you do that? So, she still loves him in the future, so I can understand maybe why he just ended up breaking up with her now. You know, he still has to fix the gang stuff. So, I guess. <laughs> I guess. I was just a little sad that he chose that route because I was thinking he was going to try to change the future a little bit more, but understandable, right? So, regardless, that was pretty much the episode. You know, now I think next episode we'll probably end up going into Christmas Day um, and we'll probably get like the little Christmas fight. So, we'll see how that goes. But that's all I got. Remember, for more Tokyo Revengers live reaction slash reviews, make sure to subscribe button down below if you're new to the channel. Hit the bell get over that drama videos also follow you more instagram twitter discord tiktok all that good stuff description box below also to remember guys check out into the am links in the description box below as well as in the comment section below get yourself that 10 percent discount and as always guys it's been your boy x and i'm out deuces